Hey everybody and welcome to this brand new custom figure review. As you guys can tell, I just got a huge massive box of new custom elite figures just came in and what we're going to do right now is we're going to open this up and I'm going to be opening all these up for the very first time live on camera here like the last times we did. So uh, this is going to be really really cool. We have a super awesome batch here for you guys today and I would say we get right into it and we're going to go through these figures here in, in this setup today and first figure that we have this was something I was so excited about personally we have from AW we have MJF and this piece man this is absolutely incredible just look at that head skin I'm like kind of amazed on how much this looks like MJF man like an angry MJF I think that looks so so much like him man and this attire right here this is going out to my friend uh, Paul so I hope he's looking forward to that because this MJF is just mind-blowing to me got the tattoos got everything that you need for an MJF got the logos on his knee pads right there MJF on the back this is absolutely beautiful man MJF this uh, right here this one is not going to be available on the eBay page like I said this is for an order but uh, right next I think we should get into one that is available to all of you guys next bubble wrap and I would say the next MJF and this is the purple attire of MJF let's just start right from the back here we got MJF holy shit man this is beautiful and using the same head scan formula and I think Angelo just completely nailed MJF man the dead is incredible looks so so much like him in my opinion I have not seen an MJF that looks so much like MJF actually so man this is just mind-blowing in my opinion man really 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 great and this MJF right now when you're watching the video it will be available on the eBay page for auction so you definitely have a chance to make this one yours and let's get into the next bag right here so Let's open this one up and uh, first figure I'm pulling out is another figure that I think is going up on the eBay page and we have from New Japan Pro Wrestling we have Switchblade J White and this is his uh, attire that he has recently been wearing and I think it's just beautiful man like you can always see all the details Angelo puts into this this is actually like molded on as well I don't know if you can tell, but this is just awesome. Then uh, we used a different head scan for a Switchblade this time around. This is a Wade Barrett based head scan. I think it looks really good with the thicker beard and everything for Switchblade like he's wearing it now. Uh, going into the uh, Tokyo Dome. And here from the back, man, very, very beautiful Switchblade. By the way, the uh, belt here is molded on as well. Looks absolutely great in my opinion. A very nice Switchblade J White here from New Japan Pro Wrestling. And uh, yeah, this is a New Japan figure as well. And this is going out to my friend Fix from uh, Instagram. And I kind of forgot the number after his name. I think it's 3-1. But uh, yeah, this is going out to him Okada. He really wanted this Okada. So uh, this is pretty much the same Okada then that we had in the uh, two previous batches. From the, new, uh, from the New Japan G1 Climax this year. Absolutely incredible Okada attire. And yeah, he wanted that to get done. And we have that ready for him uh, in this batch here today. And then also there's one more figure in here. And this is a figure that is also going out to my friend Paul. And right here we got an Elite Sean. And to be honest, I haven't been the biggest Sean Spears fan. Because in my opinion, he's kind of boring. But um, yeah, the figure here itself is really good. This is based on uh, All Out, I think. This is the match that he had with, with Cody. Uh, which I think was one of the weakest Cody matches that I've seen recently. So... Um, I just wasn't really too hyped about that, but this is Sean Spears in his AEW attire. Obviously, if you're not watching AEW, this is the former Ty Dillinger. 
uh, with all the tattoos, uh, updated head scan. And yeah, this is Sean Spears, but this is already uh, taken as well, so uh, you cannot pick that up anymore. Then we have another one right here. Let's open that up too. All right, let's get into this. And the first figure I'm pulling out here is a soon to be free agent, or maybe not soon to be free agent, because I think for sure this man is going to be going to AEW. We have the villain Marty Skrull, and this is also going out to fix uh, along with the Okada figure. And yeah, really beautiful Marty Skrull attire here. And also got his brand new tattoo, by the way. So that is new, added onto the Marty. And here's the head scan. I think that looks very, very, very much like Marty, man. And yeah, otherwise pretty much the same Marty Skrull than we had in the previous custom batch. So yeah, there you go, Marty. And then we have two of his friends and I would say we start off with Nick Jackson right here and this is the Nick Jackson from the uh, Double or Nothing show and this is a very special Young Bucks attire this is uh, pretty much different to other Young Bucks attires we previously had I think it looks very very cool man it doesn't have these usual tassels on it like they usually wear but man this white attire is pretty Pretty darn great looking, man. Really like this uh, Nick Jackson here. And obviously we have a Matt Jackson to go along with it. And yeah, same attire as Nick. And there uh, you guys can see it on the side. And these, by the way, are also going out to Paul. So these are not available on the eBay page. All right, and another bag right here. And I think there's going to be something uh, that you guys can actually pick up on the eBay page in here. So um, this is going to be a little more exciting, maybe. Okay, first off, someone I really wanted to get in the custom figure badge again for the eBay page. And that is Darby. Allen. Huge fan of Darby Allen myself. I think the match he had with John Moxley was absolutely incredible. Very, very nice. Let's take a close up here at the face paint. Looks really, really clean, man, with the updated hair and everything. Really, really like this uh, Darby Allen that will be available for auction right now on the eBay page. So if you want to pick that up, you have a good chance to do so. And then right off next, we have a figure from Full Gear. From the controversial match at full gear we have john moxley and i think angelo completely nailed this one this comes with his entrance vest entrance vest black elbow pad on the side and then also we can look at it from the back says mox that is absolutely beautiful and the head scan let's take a close-up of that looks so much like john moxley man and obviously that this uh, is removable so you can take it off and put it back on however you please to and I think that looks just absolutely great and it's based on the full gear match with Kenny Omega so if you need a Moxley in your collection this is your chance to pick one up because this one is available on the eBay page as well then final AEW figure also going to be available on the eBay page I know you guys are always looking for a Cody and this is going to be the ultimate edition kind of of Cody because we decided to go with the entrance vest on Cody. And I think this might be the best Cody we ever had, man. With this entrance vest that will come with the figure. I think that is that is just incredible, man. I love this so, so much. Um, when I saw Cody wear that, I already um, I immediately pitched that idea to Angelo that we should make that. And Angelo completely pulled it off so well man it's the uh, gold attire again that we had before but now with the entrance vest so i think this is going to be extra special here man and uh, man really really great cody this is perfect and then the final figure of this badge last badge was the fiend so this badge we had to have bray wyatt in his firefly funhouse gear and the head scan on this man let's just look at that head scan holy shit this is so so lifelike man this is almost scary lifelike look at that wyatt head scan man look at it from the back got the tattoo underneath there man 
This is absolutely out of this world wearing his red sweater and with this hand he's going to wave you tell you that he'll see you in hell or whatever man this is absolutely beautiful and you can make this Bray Wyatt yours by the way barely anything up for for the eBay page so this badge we really figured we needed to put some up and yeah guys if you want anything eBay link in the description below I hope you liked all these customs shown here to you guys today and now we will just take a really uh, quick roundup of everything that we had today in the batch. Alright guys here we are wrapping things up and I think man this batch is absolutely awesome. Um, if I would need to pick my favorites it would definitely be between this awesome Bray Wyatt right here. This is absolutely out of this world incredible. Cody with the vest, man. That just takes the uh, custom elite Cody to a whole different level. MJF with that freaking head scan there, man. I, I don't know what to say. That That is such a perfect MJF head scan. I, I can't, I don't even know what to say. And uh, like I told you guys, what is going to be available on the eBay page right now when you're watching that video? We will have this Darby Allen for you guys that will be available. We have John Moxley going to be available with the Mox vest. Let's turn that around again so you can see that. Beautiful Moxley. Cody going to be available. I think that is a must add to an AEW collection. Then we have this MJF here going to be available. The purple one. Like I said, the other one is already taken. And then this beautiful Bray Wyatt right here, man, available as well on the eBay page. I think this is just, uh, this is just out of this world, man. Incredible, incredible stuff. I hope you guys did enjoy joining me here today for all this uh, great stuff that we unboxed. Um, like I said, this is pretty much it. I guess I'll see you in hell once again.